Welcome back, YouTube. Big Sweet C here with you. Sweetness on the prowl. We're in the Lost Bastille. Uh, we just took out the Ruined Sentinels and moved into the Servants' Quarters bonfire. We're going to reattune these spells. I'm going to take heal off because I'm an idiot and can't use it. We're going to throw on our Great Soul Arrow again. Uh, just because we don't have another Dark Orb to put in. Uh, nor do we have an, an extra fifth slot uh, to make Dark Hail or Resonant Soul viable. Um, but we're here. We do have 36,000 souls. So we're going to travel back to Majula. And we're going to do some leveling up. we got to be pretty close to the point where we can use our Sunset Staff. Uh, which will make this nice. We can upgrade it one level. I have one Twinkling Twite Knight. Twinkling Tight Knight. And actually thinking of that, before I came down here, I should have totally went downstairs and tried to take on the Pursuer. If I beat him, I would have gotten a Twinkling Tight Knight. I could have leveled up maybe twice. Alright, but we do need 22 Faith, so we're going to put that there. And then, how many can we go? Can we go? Oh, holy cow. Look at this. You know what? Let's confirm this. And I believe I have some souls I can cash in. Oh, son of a gun. Yes, I do. Four thousand. I think this should be enough. Seek, seek, lest this. No, I need 7,500. Son of a gun. For that extra slot. Ah, oh well. N not that big a deal. Let's go ahead and let's throw on our Sun Spear now that we are at level 22. Come over here. How much is this going to be to reinforce? We can do it once. We are definitely going to do that. We need two Twinkling Titanite. Maybe we get one here pretty soon as we take on the Pursuer. Let's see what we got in terms of shields. Maybe we've got a better one now. I think that target shield, like I was saying, is pretty good for parries. It's a little heavier, but we're still doing pretty good on that. Yeah, everything's better except for the magic defense ain't quite as good. But let's go ahead and let's throw that on instead. Look at that bad boy. Wha! Alright. And let's mosey on. We're gonna go back to the Lost Bastille. We're going to the servants' quarters. go down these stairs now if you don't want to fight the pursuer it's very easy to get away from him just run back up those stairs and I totally forgot to put dark orb on and I forgot what I had equipped Whew. that was not smart and down I go well that was a pitiful attempt that was an absolutely <laughs> horrendous attempt at the pursuer uh, in the middle of talking not paying attention had the wrong stuff on dump that on there break this out let's see if we can do the parries You cannot parry that. Got him. Whew. 
Not that time. Oh, right through. Aha! Wow, he went right through that ladder. I got him with the parry, though, so it can be. As you all saw, I'm, again, not very good at it. All right, I'm going to give him one more shot. That's my rule. Three shots, and then we move on. Hoy. Still not quite where we want to be, but you know what? We will get there. We will get there. Finish them off. Boom! Third try is a charm. Down goes the pursuer. Whew! Man, whose heart's racing? I know mine's is. Whoo, man. Alright. So we have officially taken down the pursuer the first time by ourselves. I know, kind of pathetic. Just check. This would be the type of game that would clearly very easily put the pursuer there and a trap. But that's okay, it's not. Get ourselves this priest chime. I don't think there's any secret walls here, but we're gonna check just to make sure. Fog wall, jerk. And then we're gonna move on in to Belfry Luna. Put your Pharaoh's Lockstone in the slot. Opens up this fog wall here. And we're in Belfry Luna. Oh, I am. Okay, I am mistaken. My bad. This is Belfry Luna. Belfry Soul is the one. Oh, shoot. And I totally should have let this guy talk. What the heck? We'll try it out. We're working on being a PvP player, so we'll try it out just for this. Ringing this bell forever we have. 
Alright. I thought that was it, but I'm just... Oops, shit. Just making sure. Okay. So let's go ahead and throw that ring on, just in case. Uh, we'll do it instead of the ring of blades. That's okay for now. Uh, usually, I don't seem to get called about uh, too much in this area. More so in the... Um, definitely more so in the Belfry Soul area. Seems to be a more... Uh, PvP friendly. But while we're here, we might as well try it out. Just gonna come over here, collect this. Collect this. Come over here to the one with the carpet thing. I guess they both have carpet, so it don't really matter, but, you know. The one with the carpet. Get ourselves our blue tear stone ring, which is actually pretty good for a hexer. I think it gives you, is that the one that gives you more slots? Maybe it's the one that gives you more uses. One of the two. We'll see if there's any, doesn't look like it. Anything here? Nope. In case you don't know, that's where you came in. Grab the skeptic spice. Run back up the stairs. We're gonna come up here, kill these guys off. Shit, gonna die to a little dwarf. Can't do that. Can't be dying to a dwarf like that. Son of a gun. Instead of using that, let's actually use one of our two radiant life gems. Uh, I probably should have used that after I used this. But that's alright. Again, sometimes I make stupid mistakes. And it looks like I might have actually done it early enough. That it's not gonna matter. Alright. So let's get Masterless Glencore over here. He's gonna do some tanking for us. We gotta go ring the bell and open the gate before we get a chance to actually go into the gargoyles. But he can help out with this. Run up these stairs right here. Is he up the stairs yet? Masterless Glencore, you are taking your sweet ass time, homie. Alright. We'll come up here. There's a bunch of these, like, little guys here. Just be careful, because they will gang up on you. That's why you bring Masterless. He destroys them. He does absolutely murder these little guys. Look at this. There's one more of the guys. Master, let's do the rest. We'll check. The Radiant Life Gem. Come over here, ring this bell. That raises the gate to the boss. Do one last outer rim check to make sure I haven't missed anything. I have not. And then we'll come on back down. What is that? Just the just the lighting in the level. Don't want to miss any treasure. Don't want to miss any treasure. Alright, we're going to come over here. We're going to prepare ourselves for a boss. Don't 
dark weapon on. And we have the Belfry Gargoyles. Shit. Massless Glencore doing a lot of tanking for us. Again, this is going to be one where they can definitely very easily overwhelm you. So just take it one at a time. Try and uh, eliminate them as quickly as possible. Because more will spawn up to, I think, three at a time. We got one. It's easier if you just kind of keep one at just use one at a time uh -huh. oof watch out for the fire masterless is almost dead that could really hurt this fight Oh, come on! Oh, am I not dead? Alright, whew. Alright. I think we've got... Ma oh, there goes Masterless Glencore. So it's gonna be us and two gargoyles, it looks like. That's not too bad. Could be a lot worse, trust me. Could be a lot worse. Keep your distance. You know how you do as casters. Oh, no damage? Alright. One more. Once you get it down to one left, you should be okay. But you never want to take anything for granted. This game likes to play lots of tricks with you. Ugh. Like that. Probably didn't need to take that one, but we're going to be better safe than sorry. Uh -huh. Can never seem to tell if he's going to do the fire or if he's going to do that thing. Oh, out of dark orbs. We'll go over to some great soul arrow. Just about done, there we go. Victory. Poor Massless Glencore couldn't make it, but that's okay. Taking out the Belfry Gargoyles. Getting ourselves some Belfry Gargoyle Soils. I think that's all that comes over here. Yes. Big thank you to Master Glencore, though. Couldn't have done it without him. Come over here. I don't... Being a circular wall, there's probably nothing to get. Alright. I feel like there might be some enemies. Doesn't look like it. Alright. I'm gonna check. What do we got here? Southern Ritual Band. This is nice. That is also nice. Very nice if you want to be a caster. I'll show you what that and the blue tearstone ring do here in a second. I hit this bonfire.
Boom. I am going to rest at this bonfire for a second. Get my stuff back. And then let's take a look at our inventory. Go over some rings that we just got. Both are very nice for casters. Southern Ritual Band allows attunement of additional spells. Then the blue tier stone ring increases defense when HP is low. That is not what I thought it was. But this is nice. It allows the attunement of additional spells. Maybe we put that on uh, for the time being. Since we're still technically in the soul, we're going to keep on the bell keepers ring. We're going to put this on. We're going to come down here. And this can be a nightmare sometimes. Maybe if the dogs are all there, we can pound them with some dark orb from the top. Let's see if we can do that. Thin out the numbers a little bit. Yeah, see if we can reach them. Maybe not. Maybe not. Oh well. Alright, so we come down here. Just gotta be quick about it. Ah, the dark spirit. Be quick about it. Holy shit, I'm gonna get fucking pounded by a bunch of douchebag dogs that I cannot fucking somehow get around. Get your bullshit. This is, like I said, this game can be a major, major, just fucking ridiculous nonsense. Like, ugh, the sheer amount of people that they now have on the, in this level is insane. Alright. Get away from the dogs. Watch out for this guy. He can be a dick. Uh huh. Not even remotely what I wanted to do. God damn it, those fucking dogs. God damn those fucking dogs. God damn those fucking dogs. God damn those fucking dogs. This is why I fucking hate dogs, because they're bullshit. They just fucking... They're impossible to hit. They're impossible to fucking dodge. Apparently they are just... Mmm, this is why I hate the fucking dogs. Alright, let's see. Let's see what we can do about these goddamn fucking dogs. Alright, first and foremost, we're gonna knock this one out. So he can't come up from behind and fuck us. Then we're going to just... I should have tried this before. Oh, of course. Alright, so that won't hit him. Maybe Great Soul Arrow will. Yeah. Fuck his shit up. Am I right? That's how we do. Alright, so now we climb down. Gather a bunch of them together. Run back up. And take a bunch more out. Okay, let's put on... Oop. We don't want to go to our inventory. We want to put on our binoculars. We should be able to take them out now. There should only be a dog or two left. Oh my god. Oh, I don't have this stupid fucking thing on. Let's run back up real quick. Like a noob, I put my fucking binoculars on and left them on like an idiot. Okay, we don't want that. We want these.
can't see anything. Okay. Fuck out of the way. Alright. Oh my god, game! I do not know how many times I have to fucking change my weapon for it to actually be... Alright, there we go. Now that we got the goddamn dogs out of the way, we'll just fucking pound Mr. Vogel. Oh my god. Take some dark orb, dick. All right. Hoy, the goddamn dogs. The goddamn fucking dogs. All right. Now that I've got that, and I've embarrassed myself on national TV. Yeah, YouTube. It's only worldwide. We'll come up here. We'll collect my souls again. Come up here. Do the Channing Falcon, which actually is probably not bad for a caster if you want to use a falcon. We'll come up here, and we'll rest at this bonfire. That's going to do it for this episode. That is Belfry Soul. We're going to continue on with the Lost Best Deal after this. Uh, we were at the Servants' Quarters. we got to pick up the, the Bastille Key, and then move our way into uh, Sinner's Rise to take on the Lost Sinner. Either way, that's going to wrap up Belfry Soul. I'm going to take that ring off. Uh, I'm going to go back to Majula with 35,000. I think we can do some leveling up. Uh, pick up some life gems. Buy some stiffs. But that's going to do it for this one. Thanks for watching YouTube. Big Sweet C. Sweetness. Signing off. Peace.